I suppose I should start by asking why and have you thought this through. But beyond that, oh, I won't. However, speaking not only as your captain, but as your friend, as the good friend that I expect both of us are to each other, do you want to talk about what happened with this case? No, I don't. Well, there'll be things that have to be done. Others will have to be notified. Uh, the deputy board will want to review, and you'll have to show proper cause. Mm -hmm. They'll be losing a good man. They're not going to let this thing go easily. Listen, Fred, I'd be an asshole if I didn't try a little harder to find out why. I can't tell you why. I have not nearly enough presence out there as it is. The deputy's cousin kid comes in today. I've got detectives working the overflow in a body in Upham's corner. The shit has reached into Manapan. And if I were to lose another man of your presence out there, not to mention the shit that's going down with the commissioner, with that settlement and everything hanging over her. She's already had to let one long-standing, decorated officer go, and now to have to decide to whether, not, uh, whether or not to let another one leave? Look, Fred, you're going to have to explain this to the board. I would expect you could at least explain this to a friend. I have no more for this job, Tom. But if the case is why you're sitting here right now, telling me what you're telling me... I don't want to talk about I'm not going to accept it. This is no slight, Tom. I never took it as such. As your captain, I've learned to take nothing personal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> of course. <laughs> I'm going to respect your request that we not talk about it. But if this thing goes down on my watch, Detective, you're going to have to give me a lot more to go on than what you're giving me. Do me one favor, please. Be sure. <laughs>